Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Zach, but you guys can call me Hazardous. Thank you for tuning back into my channel, and welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video. And today, what I have for you guys is a top 3 SMGs in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. In this video, I'll be showing you guys the best 3 submachine guns to use in Black Ops 3 multiplayer. If you guys haven't seen my top 3 best assault rifle video, it's on my channel, definitely go check it out to see the top 3 best assault rifles to use in Black Ops 3. But this video is all about the submachine guns, so let's get right into the video. But before we do so, please drop a like on this video, smack that like button right in the fucking face. Let's see if we can get 25 likes for this. Thank you so much if we do hit that goal, that would absolutely make my day. And also guys, if you are brand new to my channel, then please feel free to subscribe for brand new Call of Duty content. So let's get right into this video. The third best submachine gun to use in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Is the Razorback and the Razorback is a fully automatic submachine gun and it has the best accuracy in its class with very little recoil the Razorback is a good weapon to use when defending close to medium range objectives because of its effectiveness in mid to close range combat it's unlocked at level 46 which is quite high up there which you know is the reason I have it as the third best submachine gun to use just because you unlock it at such a high rank otherwise it probably would be the best submachine gun in Black Ops 3 and the best class setup I have for this weapon is to use grip so you can control the recoil even more long barrel so you can get extra range because this weapon it already acts like an assault rifle so when you put long barrel on it it, com it out competes assault rifles and then lastly you want to use quick draw so you can aim down your sights faster especially if you're using fast hands that's a great attachment to use if you guys don't know how to make a weapon, you know, like give it the best class setup, find, you know, the three best things, or depending on how many attachments you use, find what attributes it excels at. You know, is it damage? Is it range? Is it accuracy? Something like that. And then you want to find the attachments that can increase whatever those attributes are that are already a little bit insane. So that's basically how you make a weapon absolutely overpowered. Moving on to the second, the runner-up for the best submachine gun to Black Ops 3 is the VMP, which is a, another fully automatic SMG, and the weapon has a very high rate of fire, which makes it a popular go-to weapon for rushing and fast-paced playing styles, which most people play with, I'd assume. And the VMP can also kill in 4 to 5 shots, which isn't the strongest, however, its fast rate of fire makes up for it, and it is one of the more popular SMGs in the game in my opinion and it has a decent clip size which you know I'd say compensates for the fast rate of fire the reason this weapon is second is because it's unlocked right away but it's not better than the best submachine gun I will get into that in a second but you unlock this weapon right away unfortunately if you're level one you need to play a game and get a cod point to actually unlock the weapon but it is available for you to you know to unlock immediately it you don't need to get to a certain rank for it to just be available and then you can unlock it with a cod point or a uh, unlock token all you need to do is just like literally put the game in and it's there the best class setup i have for this weapon is grip to control the recoil on the weapon fast mags to reload really quickly and then long barrel to get extra range on the vmp because the vmp doesn't have the best range of these top three smgs and of course you could change out all these attachments another great you know uh i'd say attachment setup is grip quick draw and long barrel or grip fast mags and rapid fire or grip fast mags and extended mags whatever you guys want but I use grip fast mags and long barrel lastly we are moving on to the best submachine gun in Call of Duty Black Ops 3 and that weapon is you guessed it the CUDA it's another fully automatic SMG with a moderate fire rate and very high recoil despite the weapons balanced recoil description I would say, you know, that's really false. That's what this website is saying about the CUDA, but I wouldn't say that. I'd say it has, you know, it's not balanced, it's moderate. It is very controllable. It works well in all situations, and the CUDA's range is definitely insane for a submachine gun. The CUDA kills also in four to five shots on average and three shots at very close range. The reason this weapon is the best is because it is the best of these three and it's unlocked immediately, which puts it just at that top spot. My best class setup for this weapon is, which I think the most overpowered class setup in all of Call of Duty, is grip, rapid fire, and extended mags. Grip to control that recoil or any of the existing recoil on the gun. You want to use rapid fire to increase the rate of fire, which makes the CUDA so OP. And then to counteract the rate of fire, you know, also the the grip uh, balances out that recoil. And then you have extended mags, lastly. Grip, rapid fire, and extended mags, so you can shoot even more bullets into the enemy. And you have like 45 or 42 bullets in the clip, so the CUDA is absolutely fantastic. The CUDA... The VMP and the Razorback are the best three submachine guns in Black Ops 3 in my opinion. Let me know your comments down 
in the comment section below you know do you agree do you disagree do you have a better weapon that you'd like to explain give a description of it give a best class setup and just say like why you love it so much why you think it's the best that being said guys thank you so much for watching and as always leave a like on the video like i said smash that like button my like goal for this video is 25 likes and if you guys are brand new to my channel please feel free to hit that subscribe button to stay up to date with all my latest and greatest call of duty and call of duty 2016 news information tips and tricks and live commentaries i hope you guys have a fantastic day and i will see you guys in the next video adios amigos